Hello, I'm Mr. BNSF Train, and today I'm going to take a look at this Thomas & Friends Trackmaster 4 engine pack that I got at Walmart on clearance for $20. I was going to buy just Rebecca by herself, but, that, but she was $10 by herself, and then I noticed this in the clearance aisle, 4 engines for 20 bucks, so I got this pack instead. This was obviously returned as James's tender and Thomas's box car are in the wrong spot. The mail van, Percy's mail van is backwards. It's taped together on the hood. It's a bit of wrapping paper. Just gonna open up this pack. I don't really care about the packaging. See, this is how loose the packaging is. I don't even need to cut it. Yep, that's the box out of the way. And here are all four engines out of the box. A closer look at the exclusive Rainbow Thomas, which is similar to the Push Along released that same year. I like the dark blue body, but I don't like the red underframe. And this van is something I will just repaint after filming this. James is pretty normal. Just normal James. Haven't... I don't have one of these yet. Might turn them into a custom of like one of those engines in the three railway engines because I have a spare Gordon tender and a Thomas to use the underside on. Percy's pretty much standard. They didn't paint his cylinders. This mail van looks nice. This van honestly looks better than the other one. And Rebecca. Her printing is much crisper on this version than the one that I had previously, and you'll notice the different drive wheel. I'll compare it to my previous Rebecca later, but I want to paint this one blue. You notice that the paintwork on the tender is still crooked, probably even worse. There's a bit of graininess on this side. Other than that. I just noticed something. Rebecca's tender has the rear coupler molded in, while all the other cars have separate couplers, like the old style Tommy engines. Here's a clear side view of each of the engines and their cars that came in this pack. And here's a comparison between the two Rebecca models that I have. The one that I've already had is one I customized, but you can still see it unmodified in my review I did of her back in 2019.
Now I'm gonna start up the engines. I haven't filed down any of the undersides, but you'll need to do that if you want to run them for long times over Tommy Blue Track or the old Track Master Track. Yeah, see, Tracy just got stuck. I'm gonna say moving. And they crashed. Thomas has defective switch. Oh, well, there, but if you go full, doesn't see why it's returned, but I don't care. I just, it's 20 bucks. I don't want to repaint them. I'll just probably put his batteries in James's, which were pretty low. Well, Thomas's problem was this piece was hanging too low, so the switch wouldn't go, so I had to stick this piece of plastic. I also filed down the bottom on this one. Now I've gotten all those problems taken care of, I can run the engines again. Except James, I forgot to give him new batteries. this is the last time you'll see these unmodified condition. Thomas is gonna stay how he is except I'm gonna touch up the buffers. This van's gonna be painted white. Rebecca is gonna be painted blue. I'm taking away James's coat and painting blue into one of the three railway engines, background engines. And Percy, the mail car, and James's tender will remain unmodified. Six months later. And here we are, nearly six months later. And here's how Rebecca looks now. She's been given a brand new coat of blue paint with a big white stripe with small gold stripes and a black roof. Her chassis is actually the one from James. I am just gave James the old wheels. I actually...
damaged Rebecca's old face, so I gave her a new one. This is just a printed face on some sticker paper on top of a flat of a sanded down penny painted white. The names and nameplate, the number, and the NWR are also the same sticker paper. And the engine tender are connected by a drawbar from Silver Hill Tools, which is what I use, which also comes with the triangle screws. I also took the buffers from the front of the tender and put it on her front. And additional detailing with paint pens and sharpies to make Rebecca how I always wanted her to look. This is the van that the, came behind Thomas. I painted the body this gray paint first and then I did the white body color. Kind of to resemble the van that came with the Hit Toys Dodge, but something a bit better. Kind of looks like a refrigerated van, or a great, something from the Great Eastern Railway. And Thomas just has the blackened buffers and lamp irons. Didn't really do a whole bunch to him. Now here's with James and Percy. James is just chassis swamp with Rebecca while Percy is something a lot more heavily involved actually painted his running board white actually had to take off his body and a smoke box and I even painted his cylinders green and to cover up the scratches on the back I also paint redid his back and I found that this Apple Barrel Crisp Green works the best for painting Henry and Percy. White running boards are a simple yet amazing mod to a Trackmaster engine. This is the third one I've done. I've done it to this 2010 Thomas. I also add this paper clip here to use as a front coupler. I did it on James. This one where the body and chassis are actually separate while on the Trackmaster 2 James the running board and the body are one piece since they're both red and Percy's my third. I really think a dark blue in the Sodor flag livery really suits Rebecca. It also looks good on a lot of engines in the series like like Bell and Timothy and Sir Handel which I forgot to fish out. I even kinda like the dark blue on this Thomas. Before we send Rebecca on a run there's one more thing I want to do. I already added some trucks. These are all the minis trucks from the one video I did but I forgot to add her colon just so I could show you all the how good the paint looks. Now she's all pulled up and ready to go. She doesn't perform the best on the Tommy track. So I ended up giving Rebecca some trucks she wouldn't struggle with. Because those darn minis trucks are too much for her on this Tommy track. And I also got Percy running.
So I swapped the tracks that Rebecca and Percy were on. And Rebecca performs much better on the Trackmaster 2 track. Percy does alright on the track, on the Tony Blue track. But there are points where he does get stuck. I don't know what the problem is. I don't know if I... If it's those weird traction tires they fit to them. Or they're just dead. Ooh. So I gave Percy the same load as Rebecca. And he's kind of struggling in the same spots. Not as much. Now here's Rebecca pulling the same train. She's slipping a lot more. So I swapped the motor with Rebecca's with James's. And it's performing a bit better now. No. Not perfect, but better than what it was. And before I end the video, here are some pictures of the custom Trackmaster Rebecca versus the other Rebecca that I have.